Hey everybody, welcome to the third episode of Canada Speedruns on the channel. This time we're taking on Manitoba. This one I feel like we're gonna be either in the middle of nowhere all five times or it's just gonna be five Winnipeg locations, but we're gonna have to hop into the game and see what we get. As always, make sure to leave a like down below, subscribe to the channel, and here we go with Manitoba. Let's see what we get. Middle of nowhere, okay. Is there even a street here? It's a tiny dirt trail. Oh man, okay. Kind of an interesting round just deep into the forest here. I'll try to make this work. I somehow doubt that it's gonna work, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. Going south. Manitoba is an interesting province at the crossroads of the really deeply forested, like, Great Lakes region, and then the prairies, of course. So kind of a cool place. A lot of beautiful areas like this. I'm gonna be in Manitoba next month. I'm really looking forward to it. Never been to this part of Canada. So yeah, really excited. Gonna be heading up to the highest point, which is in, like, the middle of nowhere, and then staying a couple days in Winnipeg. Gonna be a lot of fun, and let me know if you have any suggestions for food in Winnipeg, or if you've ever been to Manitoba. Leave a comment. All right, we've been going south a while here. I've seen nothing except trees and signs telling us the road is curving. Oh, is there something else here? Nope, just another useless sign and a cemetery. Badger Cemetery. So we went kind of south to pass that. Maybe that's a sign that we're closer to a larger road or a town or something, but who knows? Yeah, it is. Okay, what did this say? I think that was also Badger Road and a bilingual sign. Interesting. So, yeah, you do get some, like, remnants of French around... Like, Winnipeg, so maybe we're down there. And then, yeah, this is probably just saying that again. And then railroad tracks here. Oh, uh, what do I do? Can I go down this road? Is that something I want to do? <laughs> I don't think we can. Okay. Honestly, who knows where we're going to be. I'm just going to keep moving. We'll see if we come across another one. Oh, there's another road. Wow. It's been a while since I've seen this. And what do we have here? Oh, that's good. Sandylands Provincial Forest. Okay. What is that? And then road 10 north. Can I see this on the map? Sandylands. Is that it? Marchland Provincial Park. Oh, come on. There's Badger. Oh, Badger Cemetery. Yes, there we go. There we go. All right, we've got to be at that small dirt track. Back to the start. How am I going to figure this out? So road is angled like this here. So, yeah, I think it's going to be one of these. Road starts to curve there. Oh, man. There isn't another road here, right? I don't think there is. Honestly, it's this one. Yes, okay, that took way too long. We are surviving. Next round, this might be the Trans-Canada Highway. We're at Porcher Road here. Let's see, road is curving. Actually, heading north is interesting. But yeah, definitely big highways here and some signs. Feels good to get something like this after that round. So we're between Winnipeg and Gimli, which is here. So yeah, not the Trans-Canada. But which highway is it? Is it 8? Why don't I get any road numbers? What's this? St. Andrews Airport. Ah, there we go. Okay. So we gotta be down here somewhere. Back to the start. It was at... What was the street? Porcher. Small dirt road. Let's see. Yeah, that's this. Okay. So I think we're just right there. Good. Alright, next round. Let's get this done. This seems rural again, but better than round one. That is for sure. I don't think anything could be worse than that, to be honest. Don't speak too soon, though. Let's keep moving to the west here. This one's probably a bit farther west into the prairies, although can't really say for sure, honestly. I have no idea. Use an intersection. Maybe we get the highway number or something. Let's see. Road 128 North, and what's this? Fisher Municipality. Okay, hmm. Municipality of Bifrost. Bifrost and Fisher. Why do these sound familiar? There's no way I'm going to be able to find this, right? No. Got to do this a different way. I keep moving, I guess. Going west. Not sure if this is the right way to go, to be honest. Because at a municipal boundary, that's kind of weird. And Geoguster having a moment here. <laughs> oh, come on, Geoguster. At least I get to drink my coffee while we do this. This is fine. Road number? Is that a road number? Yes, 68. Okay, we have a road number. Finally, one that's not just 128 North. So, see if we can find that. Oh, there it is. Wow, okay. So, maybe now we can see these other towns. I See, I don't know if the municipalities show up, though. And how far does this go? This keeps going to, like, here. And that's the end. So, I mean, there's probably, we're probably not in here. So, I would say, yeah, just kind of over this way. Anything else? Ready mixed concrete four miles north Broad Valley Colony. Here's Broad Valley. Alright, so did we make it to this road then? Or like somewhere near here. That's that's possible. Okay. I'm gonna go back to the start now. Because we were on a curve. We don't have the name of this street, but if we know that we were on a curve and I went this way, towards that farm, then we maybe can figure it out from that. Like we'd be here, I think. Trusting it. Yes, alright, two more rounds. Let's get this over with. This is a city, finally. Radcliffe Road. I would put money on this being Winnipeg. Dalhousie and Radcliffe. 
Let's get out of this residential area and solve this round. If we finish this game in under 10 minutes, it'll be a miracle. So as always, we will do a second attempt here. I'm gonna just grind and get just five Winnipeg locations, to be honest. That's the, that's the plan after this, so don't go anywhere, and we'll try to get a much faster time. Ryerson something. Okay, don't know what that is. Maybe that's just a school. We'll keep it in mind, and we're going west. West out of the neighborhood. Keep sending me down side streets, but I want to stay on this one. Alright, here we go. That's a pretty tall building. I'd be shocked if this wasn't Winnipeg now. Come on, surely. What's this street? This is Pembina Highway, and Bairdmore Dalhousie. Let's see. South Pembina. What is that? Is that a neighborhood? I really hope so, because I've really hyped this up as being here. Perimeter Highway? Man, that's Perimeter Highway. Okay, so we're somewhere in here. On the outskirts of the town. Yeah, this is Pembina Highway. Okay. Dalhousie. Yeah, there we go. And the other street was Radcliffe. Daniel Radcliffe. There's Ryerson. Oh my god, I'm just going in a circle here. Where is it? There it is. All right, we have 15 seconds to finish round five. Not happening. Definitely not. But we'll see. This is middle of nowhere again. Oh, no. Dirt roads. Highway 306 in Eastview Ave. And looks like this is like an emerging suburb here. Interesting. But yeah, 306 I feel like is going to be uh, Manitoba Highway, so maybe we can find that somehow. Probably a bad idea. At this point, we just got to move. Move to the south, see what else we find here. Maybe a name of this town, another road. Anything will be good. And yeah, this is Provincial Highway. All right. And here's this tiny town. So, what is this place? Mandaco? Crossing over tracks. Come on, give me another highway. Big highway over here to the south, please. It's possible. Directions, maybe? Yes. There we go. What does this say? Rosetown, Rosenfeld, Winkler. Okay, none of these. I don't know any of these. Please show up. Winkler, good. Okay, so Winkler is to the west. Rosenfeld is east. Here we go. Ah, 306. Okay, I think we're here then. Back to the start. What was the other street? Was it Eastview? I think it was Eastview. So that's here. Trusting it. There we go. 1121. Not great. The only good thing about that is that's my birthday, but th th there's no relevance. So we're going to do this again. Try to get a lot of Winnipeg. Maybe a couple Brandons or something. Anything more urban than this seed will be good. So let's see. Come on, Winnipeg. You got to show up more than just once. Come on. Oh, maybe, maybe. Some sort of town, anyway. This is possibly doable. Co-op road. What's our street? We're on Main Street. There's co-op next to us. Okay. Let's get other stuff. What does this say? Beautiful Plains. Well, that sums up Manitoba. Sure does. <laughs> Going to the east here, into this town. Let's see if I know it. Hopefully, I've heard of it. Seems like a decent-sized place, honestly. So, come on. What is all this? Oh, police. Probably Manitoba Mountain Police, whatever it's called. Dine, explore, Nipawa. Okay. What's Nipawa? Oh, that's this. All right, good. We're here. We need, gotta get Main Street and the co-op. There it is, so we're here. Okay, good one. Next one. What is this? Middle of nowhere, but we have a sign here. Some sort of street. Urban Road? That's very ironic. <laughs> Certainly not urban. Uh, Lock du Bonnet Transfer Station. That sounds familiar. Why do I know that? I feel like all these names I've seen on the map in passing, but like I just don't know where they are or what they are. Yeah, that's this. Okay. So, Lock du Bonnet Recycling Transfer or something. Two kilometers. How does this work? Are we on this street? Yeah, there's Urban Road. Yes. Okay. That's good. I don't know how I've heard of that place, but that works out. Next round is urban again. Okay, come on. This is going much, much better. Give me a street sign, though. Or don't. Okay. What's this? Charleswood Long-Term Care. Okay, I just gotta get to an actual street sign and then see if this is Winnipeg. Probably Winnipeg. I mean, do any have, like, apartments being built like this? Surely. Come on. Alright, give me some street names. Dude, why are there no street signs? Here's one. Uh, Roblin. Okay. Roblin and Hunter's Point. Alright, that's so that's a little bit west of where we started. We're on Roblin Street, Charleswood Legion. Is Charleswood the town? Street's angled like this, so if this is Winnipeg, we'd be... Yeah, where would we be? Maybe not here. Okay, so Charleswood then. Is it Brandon? No, Brandon's all east-west grid. Oh, here, that's this neighborhood. Okay, good, good, good. So, there's Roblin, and then Hunter's Point. So we were somewhere back down this way. 
can ride at this thing, so then whatever that building is there, this thing. I think we're here. Good. Okay, two more rounds. Let's get this done. Highway 306 again. Well, we know where that is now. If I can remember, that was this town. Yeah. Wow, that is so lucky to get this. Okay, so what's our intersection here? This is Railway Ave. Are we in that same town? That's crazy. There is a railway. Oh my god. What are the odds of that? Let me just make sure this makes sense. The building there. Yeah, that's unbelievable, honestly. How? <laughs> what? Last round. Well, extremely lucky. And this is kind of hilly. Interesting. Maybe this is near Manitoba's highest point that I will be seeing in a month. Exciting times. Let's go to the west here. Come on, we can get this another five minutes. I'll be really happy if we do. Come on. Again, in hills here. Windy highway. Here we go. Signs. Road number. Speed limit. Come on. Brandon is south. Dauphin's north. Okay, yep. So we're probably in Riding Mountain area. And then is this the 10? Oh, come on. Yeah, that's 10. Okay. So what road are we on here? Gotta figure this out. We don't have time. No, bad idea. Bad idea. Oh, what am I doing, man? Oh, what am I doing at all? I don't know. 355. There we go. So we're right down here. Alright. Um, so what do we do? Go back to the start. Come on, 10 seconds. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna get the sub 5. Yeah, so we're gonna be like over here, I think. Street crosses over the tracks. Curve there. Yeah, I think this is it. There we go. 518. I played that one badly for sure. Damn it. 518 is a much better time. Let's see, where does that rank me? On the leaderboard? That is third place. We will take it, man. That could have easily been a four something if I just played the last round better, but we'll take it, honestly. Overall, this was pretty fun. Manitoba, a pretty rural province if you don't end up in the cities. Really interesting to explore, though. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to leave a like down below, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you next time.